reflecting in your deep blue eyes the day has begun you spin around you spin around you laugh to yourself and i see you shine in every color resting your head in my arms you sing la 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 my god i think i might be in love get rid of all your sorrows in the summer city you never feel alone as long as you're with me get rid of all your sorrows in the summer city And there's no place on earth i would rather be The great yellow sun is reflecting Hello? Am I live? Hello? Can you guys hear me okay? I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Ah, I'm so excited. Okay. Okay. Wow. What, what, what a day. What, what a day. Oh, what a day. I'm a, I'm a little laggy, but we're going to get, we're going to get through this despite the lag. We're going to do it. You and me, we're going to do this. So hello, everybody. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Okay. This is so different. Not having Brie like do all this stuff for me and, and just, you know, me just being like the guest. And it's different. It's very different. I like it. I like having control. Do you like when I have control? Yeah. Yeah. It's good to have the mom in control, isn't it? Yeah. Hello. Okay. Okay. So we are, we, look, I'm going to be serious now. I'm going to get my serious face. Serious. Got to be serious for this. Serious. Okay. The PayPal people don't like me. No. They're mean. They've been mean to me. And I'm not happy. Serious. So, so here's what's going to happen. If any one of you wonderful, wonderful, wonderful people decide to give me a tip tonight, it's going to go to Bree's account. And then Bree, 
is going to send it to me with a list of all your beautiful, wonderful names. And I am going to personally thank you on my debut 2.0 stream because you mean something to me and I want to thank you individually and you're wonderful. So just so you know, now that the, now that the serious, serious, now that the serious is out of the way, good. Okay. Now we can have fun. Oh, okay. Okay. I do have the PowerPoint ready. PowerPoint is, is coming up very, very soon, but, but I have to do like the thing first because look, all you can see is my head. That's it. You could just to see my head. You need to see more than that, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, right? Right? You got to see my body because I'm cute. I mean, Bree's cute, but I'm like cute. Super cute. So, ready? Ready, 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 ready. Okay, okay. First of all, like my hair. Like my hair. It's bouncy. I love my hair so much. So much. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're going to inch up and we're going to see my. <laughs> Gotta give a shout out to my kiddo. Yeah. My little top of my apron. Okay, I'm going to small down just a little bit. Small down. Here I go. Do you see it? Do you see my cute little carrots? Do you know what I keep in my pockets? I keep little sugar candies. I keep sugar candies in my pockets and I give them, I give them away. I love my little pockets. They're so cute. Okay, okay. And now you can see my little mom's shoes. Here we go, here we go. Aren't they cute? Shoes. Ah. They're my ballerina flats because I can pretend I'm a ballerina. I like to be a ballerina. I'm 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 not I'm not very good at ballerina ing, but that's okay because I try. And that's all that matters is that I try. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's scooch down. Scooch, 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 scooch. Bigger, 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 bigger. Hello. Hi. Hello. Nice to see you. Now I know you're all here for the PowerPoint. I know. I know you're all here for the PowerPoint. Um because so am I, really. I mean, honestly, that's what I'm here for, too. 100%. 100%. So let's do it. Yes? Should we do it? Should we? Okay. I have to push a button. Let me, let me, let me look down here. This, this is the mob looking with glasses. Here we go. It's around here somewhere. It's, it's here. Where's, uh, over. Oh, yeah. Okay. Ah, here we go. Hello. Here is, oop. You know what? Let me get in position first. Scooch, 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 scooch. Way over here. Whoops, whoops. Way over here. Ah, too far, too far. Do you know these controls are hard? You should see me game. You should see me game. Um, because I have hard controls during games too. Also, also, I saw somebody wanted to know if I was left-handed or not. I am no-handed. So uh, I was left-handed, but then they made me be right-handed. And so now I get them mixed up all the time. So I write with my right hand and I use my mouse with my left hand and, and I eat with both, both hands like this. Nah, 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 nah. Both hands. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. PowerPoint. Oh, wait. Yep. Yep. There it is. Ta-da! Oh, oh, oh. Wait a minute. Where's my... There it goes. Oh, I tell you. The lag is killing me. Ahem. 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 Mama Cookie. A shallow dive into deep chaos. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Are you excited? I, I hope you are. I want you all to first appreciate the fact that I made this as 2005 as I possibly could. 
um, I try to embrace the the shapies and the fonties. So I was so excited. It took me a long time to make this. And, and I want you to know I did it. I took the time because I love you and I was doing it for you. All you. All of you. All of you. All of you. All of you. Wait, 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 wait. For you. For you. For you. Okay. Here we go. Number one. First slide. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look. There we go. Okay. First, I would like to give credit to all of the people who helped make me. Me. Thank you, everybody, for making me. I appreciate it. And these people right here, these, these people, they were very nice and they gave me questions. They gave me questions so I could answer them for you. So I, I want to thank you too very much because my community is the best, the best. I love you guys. I do. I do. Okay. Okay. Next slide. Whoop. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. My name is Mommy Cookie Box. Hi. These are all the things you could call me. Mama Cookie. You can call me Bree Mom or Mama Bree. If you're very formal or or you want to ask a big favor, Mrs. Cookie Box usually works very well. Yeah. Yeah. But I like Mama Cookie the best because I think Mama Cookie just like rolls off the tongue. It just ma 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 It just feels good to say. Yes. And July 1st, happy birthday to all of you. Yay! I'm a bunny. You can see by my ears. And I bounce. I bounce. Oh, yeah. Yep. Definitely bounce. I am bunny. I speak two languages. Did you know that? Bree is not the only one. I speak English, too. I speak English very well. And ik spreek Nederland ook. Yep, yep, yep. I also speak Dutch. I can speak Dutch. I'm not very good at it. I'm like, uh... Something, something, level, something. But I, I can, I can at least, I can at least, I can order bread, and um, uh, I can, uh, I can take the bus. Oh yeah, I can take the bus, and I can, I can also call the police department and report my bicycle tire stolen. And I know that because I've had to do that three times. But yes, that is how much Dutch I know. Yeah, yeah. I have wonderful womb fruit. You all know Brie. You know, Brie. And I also have a Brie 2 and a Brie 3. Because you know what? You cannot take over the world if you do not have an army of Bries. And I've started mine. I hope you don't mind. There are two more to follow. Our 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 world domination is eminent. Absolutely. Absolutely eminent. It's gonna be wonderful. Lots of Bries. Bries for everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, girls, I'm going to make a video, those little paper cutout stick puppety videos. I love those. I'm so glad you like those because, because, um, they were fun to make and I like making them. And so you're going to see more of those and they're going to be about a fortnight because, oh, well, we'll talk about the why later. And then I'm going to stream every Thursday, 8 PM in the East, the Eastern time, Eastern time zone. Um, that will be my time. I will be there. I'll do a couple ones every once in a while, like surprise ones. Like, oh, I'll tell you now. Ooh. Okay, come close. Come close. Come here. 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 I'm gonna do the debut 2.0 on Monday. Monday, eight o'clock. Okay. Monday. I'm going to see you there, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Good, good, good. Thank you. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Excellent. Okay. My stretch goal, I want to do a D&D &D stream. I think that would be so much fun. So much fun. I would love it, love it, love, love it. And, and my stretchier stretch goal, I would like someday 
to get 100,000 subs because I think it would be really cool to have that little silver button. I do. I do. I think the silver button would be really cool. Okay, ready? Next slide. About me. Here's what's about me. If you're, you know, wondering what you can get me for Christmas. This is a great start. Ah! Ignore that. You didn't see that. Shh. Nope, nope, nope. You didn't see that. You didn't see that. That, 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 that did not happen. I lost my mouse cursor. Okay, here we go. I love algebra. Did you know that? I do. I love algebra. It, it, it's a weird thing to love, and I don't care because I do. I do. I do. I love algebra. Um, it's my favorite math. And I like doing it all the time. And I think I like it because I think algebra is kind of like you have like this big mess. It's this big mess of numbers and letters and sometimes even letters in dead languages. And, and then you like have this hot chaos of mess. And then you get to weed it all out and just clean it all up. And then at the very end, you get something like X equals five or Y equals the square root of two, something very pretty at the end. And I love to clean up numbers. That's why I like it so much. I do. I also like creating things. I like making things. I like, I like, I like arty things. Um, I'm not very good at a lot of them, but that doesn't matter because note, I said, I like creating things. I did not say I like creating good things. It doesn't matter. All that matters is you try. Absolutely. Absolutely try. <laughs> D and D. I mean, really, is it? Don't have to say anything more about that. It's 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 D and D. One more. Everyone loves D and D, right? Right. We all love it. Houses. I like houses. I think houses are cool. Houses are wonderful. And I may or may not. Okay, I totally did. Who am I kidding? I totally did. I actually got my real estate license. I did. Not now, like uh, like a long time ago. I got my real estate license and I got a key, like a special key that I can go into all the houses and totally snoop around because you know what? That's legal. But standing in someone's front yard looking through their living room, that that's um that's not so legal. No, no, that's frowned on. So yeah, I like to look at houses. If you leave your curtains open, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna I'm gonna check out your couch. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna judge your wallpaper. I am. I am. I'll probably judge it nicely because I like it. Hyperfixating. I actually like it. I do. I find out so many cool things. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. And I like storytelling. And and I hope you like hearing stories because you're going to hear a lot of them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Lots of them. Uh, hyperfixation today. My hyperfixation today was checking my power line to make sure it's still attached to my house. My power line has never fallen off the side of my house, but apparently today I thought it was going to. No idea why. That is just what happens. Um, brains are funny. Okay. Unloves. Unloves. These are things that are, don't make me happy. They don't make me happy at all. I don't like, I don't like these. I, I don't like collections. No. I, I like looking at collections, but, but I, I don't like, I don't like having one because they're just a reminder of all the hyper fixations I had. And I would rather forget some of those. Do you know what I mean? Do you ever have that where you hyper fixate on something and, and you're like, no, I don't want to remember that. Once, once I had a, a collection of cows, like cow figurines, cow shirts, cow books, like literally everything anyone ever got me was cows. But like that hyperfixation was like three months and done, and and I had cows for years, and that burned me, man. That that burned me good. I can't do it. I can't do it anymore. No. So none for me. None for me. Hot weather. I don't like to be sweaty. I do not like to be sweaty. Mm -mm. No sweaty. No. No sweaty. I also don't like white noise. I, like, Do you know like when your refrigerator hums? Oh, wait, wait. I know. I know. Do you know when the light 
bulbs hum? You know, you know. Like that, make that little beep. <clears throat> Hate it. Hate that noise. Hate it. It drives me insane. Like I just ugh, ugh, can't handle it. Can't handle it. No, 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 no. Um, there was one day it was so bad. I literally unplugged my fridge. I didn't even care if my milk went bad. I didn't care. I just, I, I had to stop. I, I just had to stop the noise. Yeah. And I've, I've taken light bulbs out completely out because they just hummed too much. Could do it. Nope. Cannot do it. Hi. Okay. I know this is controversial. I know, but I don't like pie. I think pie is a lovely crust filled with jam, like really thick, chunky jam. I don't want to eat jam. I, I don't want to eat jam. No, no. Sorry. Sorry. Um, not a fan. Not a fan of the jam and the crust. Nope, nope, nope. Sand. I hate sand. Hate it so much. It, it touches you. It gets all over you. Mm. No. No sand. None. No beach for me. Nope. No beach. No beach. No beach. And surprises. I don't like surprises. I have to plan everything out. Everything. Everything. Once, once I went on vacation. Well, okay, actually, every time I go on vacation, I do this. I get this big red binder and I put like all the maps in, everything. One time I even pre-planned and pre-booked where we would park and bought the parking passes in advance. Yeah, right? Right? Because that is how much I hate surprises. Yep. We have a raid? We have a raid? Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, you didn't miss the power point. Ah. Come on, come on, come on. Hello. I totally stole that from Bree. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Actually, and I I'm so sorry. I forgot all the Breediots came too. Hello, Breediots. I forgot to say hello to you too. You were here before me. Hello. Hello. Okay. I think we're done here. Oh, superpowers, I'm neurodivergent. Yep, those people who are neurotypical or neuroboring, as we say, in the house. Yeah, nope, 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 nope. We don't like, we don't like that here. We like the divergencies. We like the uniqueness. We like who you are. Yeah, superpowers, I got them. Also, I can do math and English. I can write and I can do calculus. So there. Haha. <laughs> okay. Ready? Are we ready? Next slide. This is about you. You. This is all about you. You. You can hang out with me and be my friend. Yes. Thursdays. Thursdays, 8 p.m. Eastern time. Always the Thursday. Always, always, I will be here. We're going to have fun. Ah, these are my Oshi marks. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I want to tell you a secret. Oh, wait, wait. Here we go. Got to get you close again. Secret time. Secret time. Yeah, yeah. Secret. Get close. Get close. Okay, okay. Here's my secret. My Oshi marks, if, if you look at them, it's like an X and an O. Get it? Get it? X O X O because you get hugs and kisses. I know. I know. I know. I know. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Yeah, it's how you show your love. X's and O's. Ah. Okay, okay. And these are my hashtags right here. Right there. There they are. So you know, I will find you. I will find you in a good way. Find you, not like a creepy stalker way. No, 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 not creepy way. Good way, happy way, happy way, happy way, happy way. Yeah, and I did, I did, I did choose the scissors because I like to make the little cutouts for my videos. So, so there you go. That that's why I chose them originally. But I mean, come on, X's and O's. How could you not? How could you not? 
It's the love. Okay. Next slide. Where is it? It's down here somewhere. Uh oh. Uh oh. I have so many screens. There's my mouse goes everywhere. Ha ha. Oh. Oh, yes. Everybody, please hydrate. Please, please take the opportunity to hydrate. I want to make sure that you are not like Brie and that you do not die. Okay? That, that would be good. Everyone hydrate. Awesome. We're good? We're good? Okay. If you want to know what I am drinking, I am drinking bougie water. I am drinking Perrier. That's about as French as you're going to get. I don't do French very well. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Fun facts about me. I don't like chocolate. I don't know. I think I'm broken. Like, everybody loves chocolate and I don't. I don't understand. I don't understand. I also have terrible eyesight. That's why I have these glasses right here. You like my glasses? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I also don't drink soda. Mm -mm. Nope, nope, no soda. No soda, no chocolate. I, again, I'm broken. But that's okay. That's okay. That means that Brie always has Dr. Pepper in the house. Always, because I don't drink it. She knows she can leave it here when she visits. And I will not drink it. I have 1,902 books. I counted every single book just for you. I did. I counted all of them. I I love books. I love books. What else? Oh, yeah. See that right there next? Do you know what that means? That means I, I could fly a drone. Did you know that? I could fly. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I have 1,902 Two? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I have like a really stupid big house. Like it's really stupid big. And and most of the books are in a room that's just for books, the library room. And I, I still have two walls to fill with books. So, you know, goals. Absolutely goals. All right. We got onto that one. I'm a drone pilot. That's what I was saying. Yeah. I got my pilot's license and everything. I can't fly a plane, though, because um, terrible eyesight. Nope. They won't let Mama Cookie in the cockpit there. Oh, oh, oh. Maybe I shouldn't say that on stream. Um, that, that can get clipped and used in the wrong way. They won't let Mama Cookie in the um, place where the pilot sits. There we go. We'll go with that one. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got chickens. I got cats. I have three cats. And I have koi and giant goldfish, but I like the koi better. So we pretend the giant goldfish are koi. But I like the really pretty white and like the orangey ones. Oh, they're so pretty. I love them so much. Uh, my favorite stems, bougie water. I like how it tickles. I think it's great. Do you guys like? Do you like bougie water? I don't do tap water. Tap water? Tap water is the devil. Nope. Bleh. Bleh. Gross. Hate it. Heard it. Heard it. Uh, yes, the koi, the chickens, and the cats are thankfully not in the same pond. I tried, but it was it was a terrible, terrible day. Tragic day. Um, won't be doing that again. Nope. Nope. They're, they're in separate spots now. And last, the train. The train. Uh, uh, it's, my name, it's my kid's name, Brita. <laughs> Brita. Yeah, absolutely. That's it. Brie number four will be called Brita. <laughs> Brita filter. A train is the only transportation that I don't, I don't get sick on. And, and I mean that. Like, I actually have gotten um, motion sickness in an elevator. Yeah. Yo! Welcome, guys. Welcome, 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 welcome. Hello. Woo! Woo! How are you?
How are you? How are you? You're in, you're you're still in time for the for the. I'm still doing PowerPoint, like a real PowerPoint. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was just telling everybody how I get motion sick on an elevator because I am special like that. So special. I, I, yeah. But trains, trains are fine. Trains are fine. Hello. You know what? I, I am amassing an army. That's what I should call you, Mama's Army. Honestly, we'll take over the world. I'm, I'm here for it. You guys here for it? You want to take over the world? I mean. We can't do any worse than it already is, right? We we could do better. We could do way better. Way better. Way better. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Where's my... Have you seen it? Where's my mouse? The, 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 the cursor is always disappearing. Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Next slide. Gaming lore. If you ever wanted to psychoanalyze me, now is your chance. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Take it all in. Take it all in. First row. Standalone or one-off titles. Now, I know Baldur's Gate 3 is not a standalone title. That's the only one I played. So it's in that list. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Now, answer some quick-fire questions. Ready? Ho, ho, ho. I I didn't romance anyone my first time around. Nope. I was a sucker. I was a fool. I was a fool. But my second one, I, I'm going for Gale. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going for Gale. Yep. I'm going to work my way through it. Stardew Valley. All right. So I have married. Here we go. Elliot. Don't like Elliot. Sorry. I, I'm sorry, Elliot lovers. I'm not. Mm, he likes to smell my armpits, okay? You know, you, you, you come you, you come out from the field and he says, I like your musk. What is that? Elliot, what's wrong with you? They're sweaty pits. Don't smell those. No. Mm. So, yeah, yeah. Look at his dialogue. It's weird. He's weird. Yeah, he likes my musk. No, no, no. I married Sebast. Sebastian. Okay. Good, good spouse. 100% recommend. Would do that again. I I lived in a mutually beneficial partnership with Krobus. Love me some Krobus. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But, but I favorite husband, Harvey. I know, I know, Harvey. Harvey, totally Harvey. And do you know why? Do you know why? Do you know why? Do you know why, Harvey? Because Harvey wanted to be a pilot and he couldn't be a pilot. And I wanted to be a pilot and I couldn't be a pilot. So I feel like we have that in common. I do. I do. Yeah. Yeah. I love Harvey. Also, got to tell you, Harvey's great. Like, he's always out there feeding and watering, which I mean, I don't really need anyway, because you already have like the auto feeder by then anyway, and you already got like all the stuff, but he fixes your fences. Like, he's always fixing my fences. I don't have to have the golden clock. I got Harvey. Yeah, he's way cheaper. Just give him some coffee. Give him some pickles. Bam. No problem. No problem at all. Uh, anything else on here that I should talk about? Uh, yes. Yes. You all know how much that Brie loves Fable and it was her childhood game. Uh-huh. That's because of me. That's because of me. <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, so Resident Evil Code Veronica, I just want you all to know that was the very first Resident Evil game I played. Yep. Yep. And then I played them backwards. And then I went forward to uh, Leon S. Kennedy, who, by the way, is mine. He's mine. You can't have him. Mr. Kennedy is mine. Yep. I got Gail. I got Harvey. And I got Leon, dibs, dibs right here, right now, dibs. All of them, mine, 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 mine. So there you go. That's them. <laughs> yeah. So the reason why these games are on here is because these games or the series are the ones that live rent free in my head. And I will quote from them 
and I will reference them and I will talk about them. Absolutely. In fact, in fact, interesting little side bit here. If you look over there in the standalones, you'll see one that is called The Lost Crown. Yeah. Do you see that little game there? It's an indie game. Love it. Love that Lost Crown. It was, it was, uh, it's, it, all the, all the sets for the game, the background images. Yeah. They, they were, um, they, they were taken a little town called Pulpero in, in, uh, Cornwall. Mm -hmm. That's in England. Yep. Yep. I went there on vacation last year. I literally made a pilgrimage to the place where they made the Lost Crown. And I have pictures of me at all the locations in the game looking like, a big dumbass, and I don't care. They are my favorite shots. I love them so much that I got to walk in greatness. I got to be where my game was. I mean, how cool is that? How cool is that? Just it, it, it was it was fun. It was lovely. It was it was a thing that I had to do. Okay. I love it. That's how much I love that game. I always like support indie games too. I do like indie people. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. All right. Here we go. Next. Uh-oh. There's my mouse. Here. Oh. I'm telling you, it's always disappearing on me. That's why I wear these glasses. Okay. Okay. Down, down, down. Dungeon lore. Are you ready for it? Are you ready for it? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I am indie. And that's why I love indies. Hundred <laughs> percent. Yeah, Dragon Lore. My favorite class to play is a ranger. Love rangers. Love rangers. I I also love 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 when we're playing and like suddenly the big bad guy like leaves out behind a rock and you're like oh no and everyone gets into battle and the barbarian goes into a rage and i'm like see ya and i run like 120 feet the other way because i got me a longbow bye see y'all see y'all later bye in fact i think i think some of my D, D buddies are on here tonight if you are hello 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 my gaming pals hello okay uh, ranger. And currently, I play a Swarm Keeper Ranger. I love her so much. She is chaos, chaos incarnate, absolutely chaotic. And and her swarm, by the way, are Twig Blights. And if you've never played with Twig Blights as your swarm, 100% recommend 10 out of 10. Lots of fun. Lots of fun. What else? Um, 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 I play three games a week. I do. I do. I do. I play three games a week. That is how much I love D and D. I love being a gem, 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 gem. <laughs> I love being a GM more than I like being a player. But I love playing. I don't care what I do as long as I get set the table, hundred percent. And I'm a pandemic baby. I started playing in 2020. Did you guys start playing in 2022? I mean, like, 2020 also, not 2022. I did. I did. I did. And do you know why I started playing? It was because because Brie wanted to play, and she was locked in the house, and she was really sad, and all of her friends wanted to play, but none of them. Oh, oh yeah. <clears throat> Two? There we go. <laughs> so uh, she wanted to play, and so I said, I shall, I shall learn to DM for you. Oh, my beautiful child. Oh, my beloved daughter. And then I sat down and I watched like 600 hours of YouTube videos and, and then wrote a campaign. Um, and that's the one actually I've been, I've been telling the stories from. That was my first campaign. So, um, yeah, that was really fun. It was really fun. I, I, I love it. And I'm, I'm glad I'm, 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 I'm glad that, um, I had a chance to do that. Changed the trajectory of my life. It did. It did. 100%. And these are the published campaigns that I played in. I played in Strahd twice. Love. Love me a good horror. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Love it. Love it. So, but I also play a lot of homebrew. 
So that's why I only have these, but I have played those. And I will talk about D&D forever. Forever. Best. Best. Okay, here we go. Next slide. Ha ha! You ready for this? You ready for this? Woo! Answering all your questions. I collected them. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Question one. Did you like did you like my teacher voice? Is that my teacher voice? That was my teacher voice. Question one. Love it. Love it. Uh, my favorites. Okay, so I'm going to throw this out there right now is I actually don't really have like a favorite favorite because I change my mind all the time. So I'm going to tell you what my current favorites are. And then these, these are just going to like happen. They're just going to happen. Yeah. Yeah. They're just going to happen. So, so anyway, ask me again in six months. I'll be different. It'll be fun. We can do like PowerPoint 2.0 or something. It'll be fun. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway, here we go. Here we go. Okay. My favorite cookie. Oatmeal with walnuts. Yep. Yep. Don't, don't, don't like the raisins. Like the walnuts. 100% the walnuts. Yep. My favorite food to cook. I like making Belgian waffles. I do. That is my favorite thing to cook. I like Belgian waffles. I have the coolest Belgian waffle maker. It has like two waffles at a time. Like two. Two? Two. Two at a time. And, and, and so you can cook one and then flip it over and cook the other one and then flip it back and take the first one off and put the next one on and flip it back. And if you get like the rhythm down, you get that waffle vibe, you get the waffle going, you can get two waffles in the same time you can make one. And they're like the Belgian waffles too. Like those really big, fluffy, fat ones that like hold all the stuff. Oh yeah. Mm, the waffles. It's my favorite food to cook. Waffles. 100%. And I make them from scratch. From scratch. Yeah. Safety food. So my safety food is currently Marie Callender's chicken pot pies. Yep. 100%. Marie Callender's chicken pot pies. Uh, I eat them all the time. I have, I, I would say I have one a day, but today I was like so nervous and so stressed out. I, I actually ate three. One for breakfast, one for lunch, one for dinner. Yeah. Yeah. I know. I know. I hate pie, but chicken pot pies are not pie. No, no. This is any, any other kind of pie. It must be Marie Callender's. It must come in the chicken flavor. It must come in the little box that you microwave for six minutes. And you cannot, you cannot, nope, nope, you cannot rip the box because the boxes suck. You have to cut them. A pair of scissors and you have to cut the lid in, in a counterclockwise fashion and then you cook it for six minutes only that one yeah oh i see shepherd's pie okay so for the record shepherd's pie and cottage pie are not pie they are heaven they are casserole they are good they are yummy Yummy. Yes, it's chicken soup in a bread shell. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I like. Okay. My Duncan order. I don't like Duncan. I I don't like. I'm sorry. I know. Please don't tell the government they'll deport me. Nope. Nope. No, Duncan. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nope. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ah, my favorite music album song playlist. What am I listening to right now? Okay. Okay. Right now, I am I am seriously like hyper fixating on uh 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 what's that word again? I forgot the word. The word where you have all the songs from a show where I'm gave ah soundtrack. Oh my gosh, why did I forget that stupid word? Soundtrack. Yes, yes. Yes, I, I listen to soundtracks right now. And I am listening to, I have, I, I'm listening to Baldur's Gate 3, of course, of course. Yeah. 
which I mean, let's just face it, is basically 101 variations of Down by the River. Uh, Yeah. Yeah. Like literally, isn't that every song? Down, down, down by the river. Like all of them. Oh, okay. Well, except for I want to live in and the, the one that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful woman sings. Don't you wish? I want to go back to Baldur's Gate 3 here. Don't you wish you can marry her? What is her name? Starts with the A. She plays the lute. I always forget her name because I call her my baby. I don't, I can't remember her name because literally she's just my baby. I love my baby. I wish, I wish, I wish she was like a romanceable character. 100%. 100%. Love her so much. Okay. So, yes. So, Baldur's Gate 3. That's what my, uh, yes. Al Alfira, Alfira, Alfira. My baby. She's my baby. Dibs. Dibs. I got dibs on her too. I got them all. Oh, I love her. Okay, okay. So, Baldur's Gate 3. Also, also, I like the soundtrack to Stardew Valley. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I listen to the soundtrack to Stardew Valley, especially when I drive, because it makes me calm. I don't like driving. I get anxiety, and it makes me calm. I like it. I like it. Okay, I could call Dibs. I could call Dibs on Ophira. I love her. <laughs> All right, so that's that one. Also, 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 I I I, I like listening to um, the soundtracks to the 2020 version of Emma and the 1995 version of Pride and Prejudice. I don't know why I have those on loop all the time. Brie number two, every number three, like just roll their eyes and they walk out of the room and they can't stand it. They're like, "Can you stop now, Mom?" And I, I can't. I I just like them so much. Bye, bye. Okay. See you later. Thank you for being a great mod. Uh, I think that's all I listen to right now. I'll change my mind. I tell you. I'll tell you. I will change my mind. And then six months later, it'll become totally different. But right now, right now, it's soundtracks. Fashion style. Okay. I, look, look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I have a mom. I have a mom style. Look at this apron, my little ballet slippers. Look at those. They're so cute. That's my style. But, 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 what, what I like to listen to, what I like to listen to, or listen to, watch, see, see, good gravy. I'm just all mixed up tonight. What I like to see. In people, I was reading your comments and I got confused. <laughs> uh, I, I I like fashion style. I I like I like rockabilly. Yeah, I do. I think I think that that is like like sexy, but not in a like I don't know. Like it's just a, a just I just an old fashioned way. Yeah, yeah. And then like. The, the puffy skirts and like the little like bustier tops and and like all the little cherries and stuff. Oh, I love it. hundred percent love it. And I tell you, the shoes. Have you seen their shoes? Like those really chunky Mary Janes? Mm. Mm. Love them. Love, love them. hundred percent. hundred percent. Love it. Rockabilly. Um, if you want to know what mama cookie was in high school um it was a long time ago long time ago long time ago back back in the last last century back back in the 1980s mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. back in the 1980s and i um i i i i dress kind of new wave you know what new wave is yeah, don't don't Google it. It will be sad because uh, New Wave was like the grandma of uh, of of like goth and or emo. And trust me, your modern styles are much better than ours were back in the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had I had this side, this side of my head. I had that shaved. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. And then this side of my head, this side, this side. Yeah, that side. It was like super long and in my eyes. Oh yeah. I thought it was so cool. I did. I did. I thought it was so cool. It was the best. I loved it. And I like would go to like watch my bands. Yes, it was the Flock of Seagulls time. I wasn't a fan of Flock of Seagulls though. 
No, I was like super cure fan at the time. Big time. And I liked ministry also. But they're a little bit later. And then I liked the Smiths, but like they became really yucky. So no, don't like them anymore. But I did at the time because that was my thing. All right. My favorite Studio Ghibli movie anime. Ah, ah, I haven't seen any. I, I haven't I haven't seen any. I'm so sorry. But you know what? We are going to fix this because because I'm gonna watch them. So you you have to recommend your favorite. You need to recommend your favorite. I'm gonna I'm gonna watch them, but I need to know which one to watch first. Okay? Which one? Which one to watch first? I mean, I I, I don't know. It's like overwhelming. They they're like so many. I don't know. Okay. Howl's Moving Castle? Spirited Away? Oh, oh the boy in the... Is it Heron? I think so. My, my chat's cut off. But this is what it is. Okay. Spirited Away and Moving Castle are coming up. Mm, okay. I will find which of those are easiest for me to find. And I, I'm going to watch one. And then I'm going to report back to you. Okay? 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 I'm going to report back. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. And my toothbrush color. One of you asked what color my toothbrush was. Um, this week it's, it's navy blue. Mm -hmm. I buy a big pack of them and, and then I, I just kind of grab the nearest one. So there you go. Okay. Okay. I, th I swear after I'm going to go through all the messages and, and I'm going to, I'm going to go through and write these down and I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, Definitely. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to pick one and I'm going to let you know, and I'm going to watch it and I'm going to report back. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Two. Two. Ah, ha, ha, ha. All right. Oh, Mr. Pigeon. Bye. For those of you that have to leave, thank you for coming in and I appreciate it. And I love you. You're awesome. Thank you. Question two. Me versus so one of you, I think two of you actually, wanted to know about me versus Brie like it's some knockout fight. No, 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 no. It's not me versus Brie. No, we collab. I love her. She loves me. We support each other. And if, if you want to get technical, I'm the Nepo baby here. 100%. 100% Nepo baby. Yep, yep. 100%. Yep, I will admit it. She's like, she's the best, honestly. Get yourself a brie. I tell you, tell you, womb fruit. Get yourself a womb fruit. Get three of them. Name them all brie. It's the best. Do it. All right. <laughs> uh, possible collapse. I do want to do possible collapse. And and I believe I believe I was instructed that, that I have to do it with somebody super cool. So if I have to do it with somebody super cool, that I'm going to have to say Umi honestly. And then I don't know who next, but you know, it'd be really cool to do a mom collab. I think that'd be cool. I think, I think doing a collab with their mom would be cool. I think so. hundred percent. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I can't. Brie collabs. Uh, yeah, I don't mind doing, Brie and I do everything together. So is, is it really collabing when it's like, you know, just like mother, daughter, sit down and play games and talk way too much session. That's not really a collab, is it? So yeah, Umi. Okay, so so you have to let her know that when I ask her, she won't be surprised and be like, "Are you crazy?" No, I'm not crazy. That'd be so much fun. Most exciting part of YouTubing, ah, uh, you guys, uh huh, you guys are awesome. You're the most exciting part. They make my little scroll bar go crazy. Look, look. Okay, everybody, say uh, cookie, please, please. Yeah. And then and then it just goes like that. 100%. Look at that go. See? That's the most exciting part. It's like power. Love it. Love it. Love it. That's the most exciting part right there. That's right there. The least the least expected process. Dealing with the bank and or PayPal. We're not going to mention them. How am I going to handle the fame? Oh, 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 that's so easy. I'm going to handle it with grace and style. 
hundred percent, hundred percent. I'm going to get two pockets on my apron so I can carry twice as much sugar candy and I can give it away twice as much. hundred percent, hundred percent. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Three. Will I sing? No. Short answer. No, no, no. Not my thing. I mean, I do sing every once in a while. Like I go, la, la, la. But I don't like sing karaoke sing. No, 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 no. No, not my thing. Ah, too much anxiety. Can't do it. Number four. Ha ha, my current hyperfixations. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. Ready? Ready? I'm currently hyperfixating on academia. I know. Weird, right? 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 Okay. I have not gone to school in 30 years. That's older than most of you. Really? Yeah. And so I decided uh, that I wanted to study. So I started hyperfixating on academia. Uh, and, and so you know what I did? I signed up for college or enrolled. I guess the word is enrolled. Huh? I did. I start like in a month, no, two months, month and a half. Uh-huh. I did. I did. And, and I've been watching like BookTube on YouTube. And, and I, I watched like, um, uh, like, like the academia, academia people, like Ruby Granger. And I'm like, that's it. That's it. That's what I want to do. That's what I want to do. So I'm going to study English literature because I love English too. I am too. So I start in the summer and I have a five week algebra three course that my advisor said I was absolutely insane for taking. He's like, Mama Cookie. That's his voice, by the way. Mama Cookie, you haven't been to school in 30 years. Why do you think you want to take algebra three? And I'm like, do I need to give you a PowerPoint? How much I love algebra? Dude, no worries. Don't worry about it. Give me, 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 give me. That's it. So I did that. And then now I'm going to, I'm going to do that. And then starting in the fall, I can take all my English courses. I'm so excited. And, and, and I found out, I found out that I don't have to take psychology because honestly, 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 do I need psychology? Have you seen my brain? Like, please, please. I live, I live psychology. 100%. 100% live it. So I was like, yeah, nah. So I don't have to take psychology. I get to take women and gender studies. Ha! How cool is that? How cool is that? Yeah. Yeah. I, I have a, I have a psychologist because that's why I don't need psychology. I know. I know. I know I'm broken. I know other people are broken and they, 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 you know, I got, I got everything I needed to learn off TikTok. Let's face it. TikTok is very informative in the world of neurodivergencies and, and anxieties and depressions and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm excited about gender studies. I really, 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 really am. So that's going to be fabulous. So I think that's going to be better for me. Uh, so that's my hyperfixation. And that's my little secret. I'm going to start going to college. I'm going to be the college person. Oh, and I'm uh, definitely going to get a master's degree. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because, um, I don't stop. Nope. Got to do it all. Got to do it all. It's all or nothing. All or nothing. Going to do it all. Yeah. Number five. Top tips of my gardening journey. Here you go. Y'all want a garden? Even if you got a pot on your porch. I'm going to tell you some, some, some real truth here. Okay. Two, two tips. Two, two tips. Here we go. Yeah. Get my doctorate. Um, okay, so seriously, I was considering it, but if I think if I said that through it to the universe, then it might not happen. So um, d- d- that's the ch- ch- that's the stretchier stretch goal. Okay, two two tips. Two two tips. Number one, Mother Nature hates dirt. If you don't put a plant in it, she will. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. So you know what you need to do. You need to do if you don't want weeds, don't put mulch down. Uh uh-uh, uh uh uh. Don't put mulch. Don't put that plastic crap down. Don't nope, don't nope, don't nope, don't nope. plant something, anything. I don't care what it is. Put a plant in it. If you don't put a plant in it, you're gonna get weeds. Yep. 
Plant it. Plant it all. Don't see the dirt. 100%. All plant. 100%. 100%. Okay. Tip number two. Here you go. Carrots. Carrots get sweet over the winter. So don't harvest them until the spring. Okay. So you put your carrot in the garden and you grow it all summer then you let it die in the fall then you let it sit in the ground in winter and then in next spring it starts to come up again and it's so sweet so sweet yeah and look i i right there see that carrots i'm a carrot expert i'm a carrot expert uh-huh yep because carrots, carrots are a biennial. That that means it's two years to complete its life cycle. Yeah, because I had a hyperfixation on on um plants already. So I can I can give you all my knowledge. Yeah. Number six. It's right here. Six. Rewards of being a mom. What's momming like? You know what I can tell you about moms? Like the really, really cool thing about being moms is I get a, a front row seat front row seat to uh to like a whole human being from the beginning okay like think of it this way you're here right now with me in my debut right right we're in a debut 100 percent, all of it together we're all here from the beginning and so you're gonna see me grow and develop and change and fall and pick myself up and fall and pick myself up and do all the things and that's what's gonna happen so it's gonna happen and you get to see all of it from the beginning and that's what being a mom is like, you know, you yeet that kid out, out of your Gucci. And then the next thing you know, your front row seat until they grow up and leave and, and then build entire fabulous VTubing community and that you steal it hundred percent. That's it. Front row seat right there. That's the reward. Front row seat. Yep. 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 All right. Having a creative daughter, what's it like? Ha! Jokes on you. I have three. Ha, ha, ha. I have three. You all, y'all don't know. No, I, I'm not joking when I say Breeze. Breeze got but two more Breeze cloned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just wait. In the next five to ten years, we're all going to be an army. All of us. How's it like having a creative daughter? It's awesome. Having three creative daughters, the best. The best. <laughs> Dealing with preteens. Okay. Some of you are no preteens. Some of you have preteens. Some of you are going to be working with preteens. So here's what I learned about having preteens because I have a fully grown brie. I have a teenage brie and I have a preteen brie. Right? Right? So three. There's three. Three right there. My experience. Here you go. This is serious talk. Ser serious. Serious talk. You should always, always catch your teen and your preteen doing more good things than bad things. Mm -hmm. That's the best. The preteens. Yeah, that's the best. Best. Because, because you know what? They know. Kids know. Kids know they messed up. They know. They know. They 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 screwed everything up. They know. They know. They know. You don't need to tell them. You don't need to tell them the room's messy. They know. You don't need to tell them they smell. They know. You don't need to tell them do their homework. Well, unless they have ADHD, then they might. But for the most part, you don't. They know. They know they messed up. They do. So, you know, tell them. But also make sure you tell them the good things. Yeah. Yeah. Do the good things. Don't be like, you know, don't be like all, uh, mm, uh, you 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 didn't you didn't do the thing and you didn't do good on your test. Bah! Yeah, don't do that. If you do, if you do, then later on you say, "Yo, sorry, shouldn't have blown up like that." That's it. But tell them the good things. Oh, and if you're gonna tell them good things, don't mess them up and don't mix them up with the bad things. Don't be like. Oh, this is a beautiful paper that you've written, but... No. No but. You keep the but away. No but. No but. It's you tell them the good on its own. 
You should tell them more good than you tell them bad. Yeah, that's my advice for preteens and teens. I mean, honestly, anyone in, in, in general. Okay, last one. Number seven, choices. If I had a choice, if I had a choice of flight with the same stamina as walking or running, or, 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 or invisibility for one non-consecutive hour per day, not affected by action. So I could do, I could do my actions. You know what? You know what? I flight. I would choose flight. I flight. Wouldn't that be great? I could like trim my, trim my trees. I could, uh, I could like, um, I could wash my windows. I could, I could be my drone. I don't have to fly a drone. I could be a drone. Yeah. Yeah. Or wild shape. No, no. I think as animals get fleas. I'm okay being a human. I would fly. Also, invisibility doesn't really apply because um, I have, like I said, three breeze. So they all are on their computers a lot and they're all gaming a lot. And honestly, I get a lot of me time. I do. I do. Well, I would rather choose flying. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Gotta find my, gotta find my mouse. Okay. Cursor. Where are you, cursor? Is it over here? Oh. Come on. Next slide. What have you wanted to know what's in the box? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what's in the box. You know what's in the box? Is there a country in the box? Is there a planet in the box? Is there a six foot parrot in a vest? Is there time in the box? Is there space in the box? A picture of an alpaca's face? Is there a, is there a desk in my box? Hmm? I think you have heard this before. I think you have heard this before. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because I stole it. I stole it. I stole it from Olympia. I did. <laughs> from the Odd Squad. Have you guys watched the Odd Squad? I love the Odd Squad. I do. I love the Odd Squad. Is there a box in the box? Oh, yeah. Heck, yeah. Will there be boxes in the future? 100%. Yeah. <laughs> So, what's in my box? I'm supposed to, at this point in time, um, um, tell you what's in my box, but Olympia does it. She just, like, pulls a pen out, and that's boring. Or forms. I don't want to pull out forms. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Next slide. Thank you. Thank you for all attending my PowerPoint presentation. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. That was so much fun. That was, I gotta tell you, and, and it was hard. It was so hard. I, Bree had to show me how to like do the thing so I can do a real PowerPoint. Like this is a real PowerPoint. Really, really. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's go back to my chatty screen. Where's my, where's my chatty screen? <laughs> Here it is. Woo! Hey! Hi! <laughs> okay. I was so scared about my PowerPoint. That was so hard. Uh, that was so hard. Okay. I'm going to wrap it up quickly so that that all of you could go do what you got to do because I, I think I think there's some critters in here and I want to make sure I get you out of here. So I I worry about your time. I do. I care about you and I care about your time. I do. I do. So quick reminders. If anyone has sent any tips again, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for everybody who came. Thank you for all the people who rated. And, and thank you to all my beautiful, beautiful mods. I love you all so much. You guys are the best. Honestly, I was so worried. And then all of a sudden I got, bam, mods, boom, done. 100%. It was the best. The best. And thank you. Thank you to my community. I love you guys so much. I do. I love you. Wait, wait, wait. 
There we go. Hearts for you. I love you. I love you. <laughs> okay. Love you. Ah. Okay. 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 Now, uh, debut 2.0. Debut 2.0. It is, it is on Monday. Monday at 8 p.m. in the Eastern time. And, and Bree's going to let me know. Uh, who, who, who you are, who, who, who donated so I can properly thank you as you deserve. And, and I'm going to play a game. I am. I'm going to play my first game. I'm going to play stacking. Have you played stacking? It's like an old game. It's like kind of, kind of steampunky, kind of like, yeah, it's cute. It's cute. So, yeah, so cute. Cute. So we are, we're going to play Steve. We're going to play Steve. No, we're not. We're going to play stacking together. So we're going to do, okay. And, 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 oh, no, it's not like Tetris. It is, it is like, um, you know, those, like those little, those little like Russian nesting dolls where like you put one inside the other inside the other. Yeah. It's like that. It's like that. It's, you have to do that. It's so cute. Oh, it's so cute. Okay. So we're playing that. And then Thursday is my regular time. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I'm just talking. I'm just wrapping up. Oh, you. You missed my PowerPoint. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm glad you're here. <laughs> hello, readers. Okay. Hello. Hello. So, uh, yes. So, Monday. Monday at, at 8 p.m playing stacking you me chatty stream and then thursday on my regular stream regular one uh i'm i'm gonna i'm gonna play that that uh what is that game that one that that brie wants me to play uh it's like an outer spacey game um i have i, I was promised i'll look at it it's called like uh what the heck is that called i can't remember now i wasn't allowed to look it up oh yeah Thank you. That's it. I don't know what Outer Wilds is. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, since Brie recommended it, I'm kind of, kind of thinking. And I've seen her thumbnails. I haven't watched any of her streams. I'm not allowed to. Uh, I, I, it looks outer spacey. So I'm thinking it's kind of like Among Us meets Halo. That's what I'm predicting. Um. So I don't know. Uh, we're we're going to see how that goes. So that's Thursday. That's Thursday at 8. We're going to play that together. It's going to be fun. I think it's going to be fun. Okay. So last thank you of the night. Thank you for being here. Thank you for, for watching my PowerPoint. Thank you for making my debut amazing and wonderful. I have I have felt the love. And I will I will see you all on Monday. <laughs>